Hey everybody, welcome back and thanks for watching Tactical Weapon Combat Ready. In this video, we're going to talk about this Strike Industries dual folding stock and arm brace adapter here. Okay, now I've done a video previously for this and we noticed that there was a little bit of a wobble here in the stock and it's coming from where it actually connects into that adapter. It's there's a little bit of space in there, so it's allowing this to wobble. So does this have an effect on us when we shoot? So I'm going to do kind of slow shooting, which I've done already, and it didn't seem like I noticed it that much. But then when I start to shoot fast, I think maybe I start to lose some control, and it's starting to have an effect on uh, my capabilities. And then a someone commented that these little pads that come with it are actually supposed to go back here. Uh, to reduce that wiggling so you can see how they're shaped. There are little cuts here in the back that fit that perfectly. So we are going to insert those as well to see if that helps reduce that movement. Then what we're going to do is we're going to remove that Strike Industries stock and we're going to put this SIG folding stock adapter on there instead. And this one is much more solid and uh, we'll see if there's any real difference in movement. So let's get to it. All right, we are back from shooting it. And when I was putting it into my shoulder, I really couldn't notice it wiggling as I was shooting on any of them. Um, but on the first one, where it did not have any of the padding, couldn't see it move at all in the video, couldn't feel it move at all, but it did seem like up at the muzzle end, there was a little bit more movement. Um, and then once I put the pads in, seem to reduce it a little bit. And then when we went to the actual SIG um, folding stock adapter, uh, it seemed like it had even less movement at the muzzle. Um, but let's be honest, this isn't like the most scientific thing uh, ever, so I could be wrong. It could have just been, I could have just been doing something strange. Um, I tried to make sure that I was in the exact same spot with the exact same stance while I was shooting it to make sure that it was all equal. Um, but those are the results I have. Um, so fast shooting, yeah, it seemed like maybe it affected a little bit. Padding helped it. Um, but obviously the more stable platform would probably be the most ideal. But I do really like the... Uh, Strike Industries stock still, even though it has a little bit of that wiggle, that movement, I still like the design and the look of it just in general, as well as obviously being able to move it from one side to the other um, and just having it with the, those multiple options and then also just removing it completely if you need to like store it or whatever the case is. I don't know why you didn't need to take it off, but that is still cool. I do like options. So still a good stock. Um, yeah, I still like it. So that's going to do it for this video. Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. And until next time, we'll see you later.